Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to tonight's main event. In this corner, it's the perfectly good strong tire. And in the other corner, it's the low pressure tire. Listen, low pressure tire, it's obvious that you're not properly inflated and this is gonna cause serious, serious issues. I can hear that you're already losing air. This isn't looking good for you. I'll spare you the details of that square off and confirm what you probably already expected. Ladies and gentlemen, it was a blowout. No, really. As anticipated, the prolonged effects of high wheel end temperatures caused by low tire pressure could result in your tire overheating and rupturing. This is a prime example of why proper tire inflation is crucial for safe and efficient fleet operations. As a tire loses pressure, the sidewall begins to flex more and heat builds up within the tire. If the overheating gets severe, a section of the tire can separate from the carcass. While that's a worst case scenario, there are plenty of other reasons why low tire pressure is your fleet's worst nightmare. Increased rubber to ground contact means more wear and tear, and that means higher repair costs and maintenance related downtime. Fleets are constantly striving for maximum efficiency, so the demand for products to help improve operations is on the rise in the heavy duty space. That's why tire solution providers are committed to the production of technology that keeps your wheels rolling in the right direction. Let's have Craig Smith, Vice President of Marketing and Communications at Pressure Systems International, join the conversation to explain how ATIS technology on trailer tires helps to keep wheel and temps at bay. So automatic tire inflation, or ATIS as we all call it really, um, it keeps tires from running underinflated by continuously filling a tire that's developed a leak. Uh, so if a tire, you know, the one thing we'd find when a tire runs underinflated, um, it can begin to uh, generate increasing temps, which can really impact the wheel, tire, and uh, wheel end area. So uh, basically the tire effectively can become like an oven um, that would, you know, that sort of bakes that area. Uh, and that wheel end at which it's mounted, and this can include the, the uh, bearings uh, as well. So, you know, one of the benefits of proper tire inflation is, is you know, tire life extension, up to 10% we found. Um, the uh, It also protects the uh, tire casing, uh, and that's, that's important for the integrity of the casing for retreading. Um, fleets can also expect a uh, fuel increase up to 1.4% we found on the average, and uh, that's, that's great for fuel economy. This is great in it being that tires and fuel make up two of the highest costs in the industry. But this type of technology also mitigates the potential for much more severe outcomes, such as breakdowns, accidents, roadside calls, and of course, the costly hit that comes to profit from repair fines and downtime. Should the indicator light go off and air starts pumping into your tire, you can choose to sideline the truck there depending on the severity of the leak or continue on to the next cup and allow the system to do its thing. Companies like PSI and other tire management solution providers additionally understand the importance of not just staying alert regarding tire leaks and punctures, but also actively monitoring the state of each wheel end. PSI recently introduced Digital Therm Alert, a system streaming real-time temperature readings for each wheel end directly to a TPMS portal, even while the vehicle is in motion. Fleet's equipment run at different temperatures based on the load, uh, the rows, uh, drivers, uh, you know, break-in periods for different kinds of equipment. Uh, for example, disc brake systems we found seem to break in at a higher temperature than, than traditional drum brake systems. So uh, these type of uh, break-ins and high heat situations can be, you know, closely observed and noted. And then this allows the fleet to find their normal operating temperature. So we're not getting false alerts and things like that a great way to establish the status quo for operating conditions. Identifying wheel end failures promptly and keeping a close eye on the state of each tire is crucial to reduce the risk of a wheel off situation or worse. Keeping those tires in tip top shape will help ensure your trucks stay on the road. For even more trucking and equipment content, roll over to the Fleet Equipment site at fleetequipmentmag.com. 
See you next time. 